One of the most important things when it comes to making money with MEV is finding projects that have potential and you cannot make a lot of money with ideas that are well known. You gotta find things where not many people are aware of and use your existing knowledge about MEV private transactions and bundles to extract a profit. So in today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how to find unique opportunities that are very high profit with low risk because not many people know about them by using some research. And I will show you exactly the steps you need to take to research and find projects that are profitable and the way to exploit them by making MEV bots that use those projects and uh, to their full potential basically. Just like someone figure out how to make profits, uh, uh, make money with MEV on Uniswap and lending protocols, we are gonna do the same thing and find a way to make money without relying on existing knowledge. We will build something from scratch by finding projects that have potential to make us money. So when it comes to researching, you gotta start at some place like Bird Eye or any type of token aggregator page that allows you to find many projects that are trending. I want to look for projects that are trending because there is liquidity behind them and there is money behind them, which is good for us as MEV searchers. So I simply go to any chain that I like. In this case, I went to Solana. It doesn't matter because any, all the chains have opportunities. So I simply went through the different trending tokens and I found, by the way, none of the, the tokens mentioned in this video are sponsored. These are just for information purposes. Nobody pay me to promote these projects. It's just me finding interesting projects. One of them is Bozo. And here I saw that it's a trending project. It's the number eight in the trending list. And it looks very good, you see. There's a uh, different, you know, different areas here. And I found that they have a swap. Now this swap is a very good thing. If they had their own liquidity, we could create our own MEV bot that targets this specific swap and sandwich transactions. There are many MEV, you know, there are many decentralized exchanges that have their own system, that have their own liquidity, which means they can allow us to sandwich those transactions that are made on that decentralized exchange. I don't know if I'm explaining myself correctly, but the idea is there's a new DEX with its own liquidity, which means no other type of MEV bot is targeting that DEX. We can be the first ones and the only ones making money with sandwiching and arbitrage on that particular DEX. In this case, I've realized that this DEX is not um, a real decentralized exchange is just a wrapper for Jupiter, which is the leading decentralized exchange on the, on Solana. If we go to the transactions, you can see that it says Jupiter after I made a swap here. But the idea is you go through a project, you find different utilities, you are looking for utilities and see what's behind them and how you can exploit them. This is a very intuitive thing you had you gotta research and you gotta explore and interact with many different applications until you find something that has the potential to make you money. And from there you can simulate an idea and implement an idea where you can make money. In this case, my idea was to extract money from a, a decentralized exchange that has its own liquidity, but I figured out that this one doesn't have its own liquidity, it's just using Jupyter which is a very popular exchange. And that one has many, I guess, many sandwich bots already. So there's not much money there. So I simply ignored this idea, I move from this project. And I move to the next one, but it's a, this is how you research projects. This is how you find MVP opportunities. In this case, I, I went to Dexview, another popular page. And I went again to the popular list, to the trending list, and I found the Chinese Dragon project. Now, this one has its own NFT game. Again, nobody, none of these projects pay me anything. I don't know nothing about these projects. I'm just showing you how to research them and find money-making opportunities. So this one has an F NFT game. And as you know, uh, NFT games can pay you a lot. This is a click to earn NFT game, which means we can create an auto clicker that will somehow click buy itself and extract 
all of the profit that can be extracted from this application. But the, right now there is no no game yet, it's not implemented, maybe in the future, so I will keep a close eye on that. Uh, yeah, and, uh, and, um, and we'll see what happens with this one, but yeah, th this is the thing, you don't know which projects are going to make you money, you got to find projects that have utility. Now another project is this one, as you can see there's nothing about this project, there's no utility, there's no DAP, no, no DeFi, they have a swap exchange, which is, which is great. In fact, I will interact with that right now, and, and I will see if if they have some kind of their own liquidity. But I guess they not. They don't. Let's see if they have their own liquidity. And if they do, that's a very good way for us to make money because then we can make money by simply, you know, profiting. You know, pointing our sandwich bots to these type of applications, but it seems like it's not even working. So yeah, that's the thing. You don't know when and how you will find a profitable MEV opportunity. In this case it seems to be loading, but it's not doing much. In any case, I'll I'll come back to that and I will see if there's something that we can do from here. But if it's if it doesn't have its own liquidity, we can just ignore it because then there is not much we can do in terms of MEV. As you know, there is arbitrage, there is some chain liquidations and many other different ways for us to make money. Another page, Avidex, this is a popular one. It shows you again trending projects. I simply go here to the hot list and I go through each one of them and I go to the info area. Here you can see the website. I simply enter the website as soon as I can. And I found this one, it has, well, it will have its own game. And I guess it's a play to earn game with, where we can exploit it to extract some profits ourselves. We simply find the mechanics behind them, but uh, since there's no game, we can move on. But the idea is, is that you find projects that have utility, that provide rewards for users or not. Maybe there's a DeFi application that uses lending or, or swaps and you can exploit those, but in this case, there is nothing there. Let's take a look at another opportunity here. Again, Avidex, I found this project, AIT, and they have a website right here. And this one seems very interesting because they have a lot going on. There, There's a different, well, there's a, an AI that pays you for, for training AI. I don't know exactly the idea behind it, but it seems that you train your your program and eventually you will make money from staking or something like that. I don't know the idea behind it. They don't they didn't pay me for promoting this project. But your goal is to take a look at the white paper, figure out how the rewards are being distributed and uh, exploit that. Create a bot that will do the work for you or find the most optimal strategy for extracting profits from this type of DAP. This one seems promising just from the looks of it, but uh, it's not implemented yet. Seems like there's only a test net. So that's the thing. You got to keep track of many different projects and see, okay, which ones are releasing and what's, what are the opportunities behind them? And the opportunities come from understanding the ways you can make money. You can, sort transactions in the way you want. You can extract profits with sandwiching, arbitrage, liquidations, and you can position yourself in the order that you want when it comes to when it comes to transactions in the blockchain. That's how you make money in crypto as an MEV searcher. And yeah, you're looking for long tail MEV opportunities and one of them is gonna be in one of these projects because these projects are trending, there's a lot of money behind them, there's big communities and m some of them most of in fact half of them i would say have utility have a tab that you can use to either stake or trade or deposit or whatever it's just you use their apps and see if there is a reward to them and if not you can see how people are making money that's there's a lot of research intuition to this but eventually you will realize that there is a way to make money and 
you will find a long tail opportunity by using this method that I explained. You've learned how to find the different token aggregator pages. You can use Avidex, DexView, DexScreener, BirdEye. These are the main ones. With those ones, you can have thousands and thousands of different tokens to explore. Then you learned how to analyze projects. You simply take a look at the at the website, see what um, applications they have. You enter into the application. You see, okay, this seems interesting. Let me take a look at that. If you, if it's something that you've seen before, like a Dex, you see if there's if they have their own liquidity. And if not, you simply extract. Well, you learn about the project. You read the white paper and see the different opportunities that can be found on that project and how you can exploit them. This is a very intuitive thing, intuitive thing. And it comes down to simply spending hours and hours into researching project. But I spent a few minutes and I already found three or four interesting projects that I can use to extract long tail MUV. This is how you do it. This is how you research projects. Once you see how the dApps work, you gotta use your assistant knowledge of MEV and tokenomics and the different ways that you can extract money and be creative. From there, you can create, you know, money making machines that do a ton of work for you, a ton of money for you. Like as we've seen with Uniswap and MEV bots on there. Hope you like this video. Subscribe, subscribe, and share it with your friends, your best friend in crypto and. Make sure to leave me a comment with the next video that you want to you want to see the, the different content that you want me to create. That way I can make those videos for you. But remember, in crypto you always want to pay attention to what's trending because trends go up and down. And when they go up, there is a ton of energy, a ton of money to be made. So pay attention to trends in crypto. Learn about them. Spend hours on the different token aggregator pages because that's when you see the hot the trending projects popping up before anyone else and that's your opportunity to make life-changing money see you soon